There, that's better. All clean. He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. What are you doing here, donkey? <laughs> and what are you talking about? I'm talking about Santa Claus. You know there's only 159 days left to Christmas, so you better be good. I better be good? How about this? You better be scarce. Now go on. I don't care about Christmas. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle all the way. Don't get... <laughs> There's only 51 days left to Christmas. Now you need to get your big green button gear and go get your marshmallows because everybody knows without marshmallows, sweet potatoes are nothing. Ah, enough. I don't care about any of this nonsense. Now shoot. Okay, okay, but don't say I didn't say I told you so. Ah. Ah. Laughing all the way. <laughs> oh, man, it's finally here. Tomorrow's Christmas Eve. You got everything ready? No. You mean you haven't trimmed your stockings or hung your chestnuts or, or roasted the tree? No. Or signified your put dunk? <laughs> Will you get it through your thick head? No one here gives a hoot about Christmas. A white Christmas. Oh, how perfect. And it's our first one together as a family. Isn't this exciting? Uh, oh yeah, how about that? <clears throat> Princess, I think there's a little something Shrek needs to tell Don't ruin the surprise for her, donkey. <laughs> okay. Surprise? Oh, I love surprises. You're the best. Come on, let's go make some cookies. Okay, you did, man, you know that, right? Um, hold that thought, I'll be right back. <laughs> You're still open. No, no, uh, we're closing now. Merry Christmas. Wait, wait, wait. I need your help. I have to make a Christmas. And I have no idea what it is or how to do it. Why didn't you say so? That's super. I know all about Christmas, and I have just the book for you. Christmas for Village Idiots. It's all spelled out, see? Step one, decorate the house. Step two, the stockings by the fireplace. Step three, the Christmas feast. <laughs> What's that? Step four, that's the Christmas tree. The tree goes inside the house? Anyway. Step five, the telling of the Christmas story. This is the step that says, I have created the perfect Christmas for my perfect family perfectly. See? Family by the fire, everyone cozy and warm, happy, happy, voila! Um, sure. Look, long story short, it's all right here. It's no problem. Oh, perfect. I mean, how hard can it be? Yes. I didn't get the egg nuts. Oh, 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 sorry, now. How about twice the night action for marshmallows. you? Marshmallows. Sweet potatoes are nothing without marshmallows. Bye-bye. Have a super Christmas. Oh. You? Ah. Oh, Fiona, what are you doing up so early? Oh. Wait, are you okay? I'm all right. <laughs> what are you... Uh... Are you decorating? Uh, yeah, that. Surprised? Yes. <laughs> well, this is our first Christmas together as a family, and, you know, I just want to make sure that it's perfect. Shrek, I think... It's beautiful. It's passable. It's horrible! No, donkey! You know, they usually just toilet paper and run away, but whoever did this means business. Now, you gotta get rid of all of this junk and get yourself some tinsel and doilies and ribbons and maybe some of those plastic what reindeer. What exactly is it you wanted today? Oh, come on, it's Christmas Eve! And I brought you a little something. Go ahead, take a couple. I bought plenty for everybody. Oh, isn't that... Nice. Well, thanks for stopping by for the brief visit. But as you can see, there's a lot of work to do. I'd just like him to wait to the last minute. But don't you worry, Princess. If there's one thing I know, it's Christmas. Now, Shrek's gonna want my help, and he's gonna want my advice, and he's definitely Actually, gonna want... I think what he really wants is a nice family Christmas. Oh, a family Christmas. Yeah, it's the first one with the kids. Oh, don't say another word, Princess. I know exactly what you mean. I got a lot to do now, so I better get moving. Thank you, donkey. <laughs> uh, and Merry Christmas. All right, Merry Christmas. Love and joy come to you. And to me so well, too. Donkey. <laughs> He's right. It's Christmas Eve. How am I ever going to get this done in time?
This is going to be the best Christmas ever, and we're going to do it together. So come on. Well, we all did it together. And now, what would the perfect Christmas be without a Christmas story? <clears throat> Twas the night before Christmas, and all through the house, not a creature was stirring. What? No Christmas tree! Oh, not you! We're here to smother you with Christmas love. Absolutely not, bad donkey. <laughs> Go home. Now, how are you going to have Christmas without your family? Merry Christmas. Well, what a nice surprise. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Okay. I will assume the position. <laughs> I am the joint field spy. Oh, man. Don't you know this is where Christmas stockings go? You can't be hanging your dirty laundry up here. Don't. <laughs> You don't touch anything. <laughs> How is the roast chestnuts on this little bit of pie? Hey, baby, you mad? <laughs> that was our supper. <laughs> Did you hurt yourself when you fell out of bed? Yeah. Baby, going to put it? I don't know. Say so you want to put it. Well, let's put it over here. So I got to start with the feng shui. Come on, everybody. Occupied. It's me. Shrek? Yes? Come back to the party, please. Mm, I don't think that'd be such a good idea. Come on. It's not that bad. Okay, I know you're not a party person, but... But what? This is not the kind of Christmas I had in mind. They're our friends, Shrek. They all mean well. How many babies did Fiona have? She has babies? I don't know. I'd better get back to the house. I'm surprised they have a house to go back to. Are you coming? Oh, I can hardly wait. Oh, finally! 